Alright, what is good, Crashers? You already know, it's your boy, Rockin' Rhino, and welcome back to another video where today we are making some homemade, from scratch, Dutch oven cornbread. It goes really good with chili, you can have it for breakfast, butter on it, it's gonna be good. First, add your two cups cornmeal and one tablespoon baking powder and one teaspoon salt. Today's magic number is four. One tablespoon. Ah, 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 ah. Two tablespoons. Ah, 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 ah. Three tablespoons. Ah, 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 ah. Four tablespoons of flour. I usually use a metal one. But I'm going to take a slight whisk with a plastic one today. And I'm going to stir all the dry ingredients together until evenly incorporated. After that, add one and a quarter cup milk. I used buttermilk because I like the extra tang that it adds. But you can use any kind of milk you would like. Stir that all together until it forms a batter. Crack two eggs and beat them. It looks like chives made an appearance in this episode. Remember your three R's. This episode is brought to you by the letter R. Then pour your eggs into the batter. Along with one tablespoon of cooking oil. Mix this all together until everything is evenly incorporated. Wow! The whisk turned into a spoon! That's crazy! Stop like now. Now dump your mixture in a lightly oiled cast iron Dutch oven. Man, do I need glasses? Oh, no, there we go. Remember to use good coals, unlike the trash here. Place your coals in a circle and set your Dutch oven on top of the coals. And then place your lid on the Dutch oven and add about 12 coals on the Dutch oven lid. These coals really are bad. I guess you get what you pay for. Rotate lid and base opposite directions every 15 minutes till done. When done, the cornbread should look like this. The cornbread should separate from the Dutch oven. If the top isn't cooked, remove the coals from the bottom and cook the top a little bit longer. Guys, this was a lot of fun to make in what are you laughing at? I got I got my cousin Eliana here. Okay. But this was a lot of fun to make in the Dutch oven. It's really crispy and you can it's like it looks so beautiful. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> I can't get it. It's really good. It's got like a nice flavor from the buttermilk. It's a little sour. But and then it's nice and the crust is really like crispy it's nice and golden brown and then we threw a little honey butter on top of ours because that really so you add a little sweetness to it because this is not a sweet cornbread so if you're making this recipe expecting sweetness it's not a sweet cornbread so we add a little oh and Caleb obviously he approves he approves 
It was really fun to make. Crashers, cornbread is a lot of fun to make out in the mountains. Dutch oven, it is so good. It's got a nice crust, okay? And it it's just so good. Have a lot. I hope you guys try this recipe. You can do it in your oven too, in cast iron or something. Okay, way better than the box mix. It was really good, and you guys should really try it. Oh my god, a bear! <laughs>